longer because you can't have a baby stand up on two legs. So we checked their posture like this. And look, they like this, really, because they've been hanging upside down for nine months anyway. Now, see how her head tilts to the left a little bit? So that's the side I felt the atlas out on, too. Yeah, you like that, don't you, Sarah? Or, hey, not, not that much? Okay. So let's go back down here now. Okay, there we go. So we're just going to put some really light pressure in here. Yeah. Yeah, that's all it is right there. It's just really There it went right there. Do you feel that? Yeah. Good girl. Let's just get her little atlas here. And and you really for babies it's just it's just a really a light touch and a very, very smooth and easy little pressure. And that's all it is. That's all it is. Here, I don't know if you can tell, but she just got this real very specific patch. It'll look more than that because she's so flexible. I'm going to have to get some extension in her spine. Okay. I'm going to take that contact there like that. I have to, unfortunately, just extend her a little bit to get it in the right place. That's why we... That's why we be quick. That's why we... That's why we be quick. Hey, darling. Hey. Okay, go. Okay. Hi, this is Maggie. Yeah. She's like, it is me. Yes. So Maggie came in to us about a month ago with torticollis. She had severe torticollis. You can still see a little bit of it, so her head tilted to the left. And she wasn't able to turn to the right, correct? To the left. To the right. She couldn't turn left. She couldn't turn left. So it's been, it's been sort of a curvy road. She's, her torticollis is quite a bit less, and her rotation is quite a bit more. And it goes back and forth. It's it's off and on as to which one we're getting more progress with in in the visits. But Maggie's doing really well, so we're just gonna check her. Every time she comes in, we check her first the first two bones of her neck. Right, Mag. And Maggie does a great job. You do. So we're just bringing it right over here, just to open up that joint space. And then I put a little impulse in. Good job, Mag. It's nothing like what we would do with an adult because children, and especially infants, their their bones move so much easier. Right, Maggie? She's like, infant where? Who's an infant? And relax again for me, Mag. Good job, baby. Hey, Karen, so what have you noticed with Maggie as far as... So she used to tilt her head a lot mm -hmm. when she held it up straight and now she tilt. All this, so she's very good with tummy time because whatever happens to one end of the spine, especially with infants, affects the other end as well. So I'm holding a Logan contact to help her pelvis shift over. Good job, baby girl. You look at it, mommy. Good. And I'm just going to check her torso as well. Come on.
Let's check up top. Oh, she's got a little there. There we are. There. There we go. Good job. A little bit more there. Good. It's all it took. Good job. Go ahead and put Spines is as if it's like a think of a ripe tomato, and you just want to barely indent that ripe tomato with your finger, and that's how much pressure. So I'm gonna have her go on her back. Actually, she's gonna go on her back for me, just like that. Hi, hi, you're doing really good. You're doing really good. Go back and forth. She's gonna like wiggle. And actually, I'm feeling now that her left side is tight, so I'm gonna do a little bit of pressure my fingers just like that just like that and that's good and that was adjusting the neck so you can see that there's not a lot of pressure at all they really like this when they go up their legs <laughs> you can see their legs moving and she's looking up at me you like that yeah and I'm gonna feel for the pelvis here and see how the pelvis is moving <laughs> I'm gonna have her I'm gonna try to push her on her onto her tummy now Onto your tummy. Bring your arm out. There we go. And I'm feeling that her right hip is a little bit stuck right in here. And that was it right there. You can see that there's not a lot of force uh, that we need to put into the spine. 